What's up guys, Sean here with Spencer's Lawn Care. Today I want to talk to you about marketing and what you do to market your business in your area. As you guys know, there are a thousand different ways to market. You can use Craigslist, Facebook, you can use a website, you can run out and pass out flyers. You can do it a million different ways, guys. But what i found that works for me and anybody in my area, other businesses that know of me in this area, will always say, hey, I've seen your signs everywhere, and I do this almost every year or at least every other year. This past year, I took it off. My, my website brought in enough that I was pretty comfortable with, but the year before that, I hit it up crazy. I think I did around 75 signs that year I put out, and I was getting calls out the wazoo, guys. And not, not just from customers, from other people wanting to know, hey, where do you get your signs? And to be honest with you guys, I don't ever tell them where I get my signs. I don't want to give my competition a, a heads up on where I get my signs made at and what I do. And I have changed over the years. This is the first year I've went with this company that I'm going to show you guys here in a minute. And I'm going to open them and show them to you guys and, uh, you know, see if it's something that you guys are interested in or if you think's worth the money. And I'll say it like this right now, guys. You can spend a lot of money on signs. You can spend a lot of money on door hangers. Okay? Right now, this company that I'm going to tell you guys about in a minute, you can get 100 signs made with, with lettering on just one side for $100. Okay? Now, that doesn't include the metal brackets that you put them in the ground with. Okay? I ordered those extra. Because two years ago and four years ago when I did signs, I didn't order the brackets. I uh, actually made them myself out of coat hangers. But uh, it just takes too long. And honestly, guys, to pay an additional $65 for the metal brackets that you get with them, it's well worth the money. So between 100 signs and 100 brackets to hold the signs in the ground, I have, an, I have exactly $165 here. I'll go ahead and plug in right here a screenshot of my bill. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and open them up and uh, take a look at them. Alright fellas, that's how they come in the box, okay? It looks like they did them in sections of 10, from what I can see. You can, you can tell where they put them in in sections. But there's 100 signs in here, okay? Cool packaging. They got it nice and packed together. You're not going to get them all uh, messed up or anything. I have to spin it around for you guys. Now, you can see this side I did not get anything put on. Now, they do offer it. You can get lettering on that side also. But this is basically what I got made up, guys. As my name, nice big bold letters, and my phone number, nice big bold letters, okay? And they're all exactly the same. You can reach in here, pull out anywhere you want, turn them around, exactly the same, okay? I think they look good. It's got a nice shine to it. It's going to hold up well. And I like to say this, guys. A lot of these signs, when you put them out, people will take them. Your competition will take them, uh... You know, people will just stop. They don't like people putting up signs. They will rip them out and take them, okay? That's why I like going through a company like I went through here, okay? 100 signs, guys, for $100 plus the brackets, an additional 65 So I have $165 here and all my signs in my brackets, okay? I'm only going to put out 50 signs probably this year from this, from this box. And then I'll do an additional 50 And I'll say it like this. The reason I'm only going to put out 50 is because when I did 75, I could not keep up with the calls, guys. No joke. I was getting calls so frequent that I couldn't keep up with going out and estimating them. Especially in the spring, you guys know. <laughs> you go out there, you're working, and then you got to go do estimating either before, during the day, or afterwards. I couldn't get to them all. So I'm only going to put out 50 in the exact areas that I want to be in, that I'm already in, Okay. I want to market directly to those areas. So, hope you guys can see the finish on it. It's a nice shiny green. I think it looks really well. Uh, my first impressions, I, I, I'm digging them. I really like them. 
The only thing I, I can see right off the rip that maybe I wish I would have done is maybe went with a little bit darker of a green, maybe like a wood forest green or uh, something like that. I mean, this is dark, you can clearly see it, but I like to have dark, bold letters, okay? Now, when you go to this website, an additional thing is, guys, to think of this here. You can box this area in here. This is a one color template, okay? You can only get one color, so your letters and your number have to all be pretty much the same thing. But see, I can get away with having my numbers white and my letters green because there's no color on this. This is just the background, okay? So I put a green box here with my white lettering of my number that helps it stand out. It's bold. And then I have my business name at the top here. Some people don't even put their business name. I like to because I don't want people to think that my company is associated with the 20 other signs that are out there that just say lawn care or cheap lawn care or affordable lawn care and then the number, okay? I want people to know when they call, this is Spencer's Lawn Care. I'm here. You guys have heard of me. I'm reputable in my area. People are talking about me. They like the jobs we're doing and this is my company, okay? I'm not just going to put lawn care on here, okay? So these are the signs, guys. I, and, and like I said, you can reach in anywhere here you want. Same exact thing. Everything looks great. I'm uh, extremely happy with them. Uh, I'm just kind of flicking through myself here, guys. I really haven't got a chance to look a whole lot. So I just, I just want to make sure the quality is as good as what you know they're saying. And they all look exactly the same. So... Let's go ahead and measure them. I don't remember exactly the size I ordered, but I want you guys to know exactly what I ordered, okay? So these signs are exactly one foot, 12 inches tall, okay? Exactly one foot. Let's go sideways here. They're exactly 18 inches wide, okay guys? So you're getting a nice wide sign. So 18 inches wide by a foot tall. Let's go ahead and open up the brackets and take a look at those. All right, fellas, let's go ahead and open up these brackets here. Told you to stay there. All right, guys, so this is how they come. I pulled this big glob of them up out of here because they're really crammed into this box, but I understand it. You have to put 100 of them into a box to ship it for a decent price. So uh, let's go ahead and grab one here. We'll go ahead and measure it real quick. I don't remember the sizes I ordered or anything. You can get these signs and uh, stakes in different sizes. All right, so we're looking at 10 inches wide. I don't know if you guys, know if you guys can see that or not. 10 inches wide by... You're looking at 15 inches tall, okay? Now you gotta remember your sign's gonna come halfway down, so you got about seven and a half inches there that it's gonna be sticking up out of the ground. Let's go ahead and throw one together real quick. Now, some people like to be very precise with these, like, oh, I gotta get it exactly where it needs to be. I'm not like that, guys. I really don't care as long as it looks decent, okay? I'm not worried about if there's five inches here or four inches here. But that's pretty much what your sign is going to look like, guys. You're going to have seven and a half inches of the sign sticking up out of the ground. Now, you are going to probably put it in the ground a few inches, probably at least two to three inches. So, it's still going to be sticking up off the ground at least four inches. And, yeah, that's what it looks like. I think it looks pretty darn good. What do you guys think? I'm extremely happy with it. And I'll say it like this, guys. I am not endorsed by this company in any way. They have not paid me. They have not asked me to do this video. This is just me trying to help you guys out. I really didn't even want to make this video, honestly, because I have competition in my area just like you guys do. And I put signs out every single year. Well, every other year at least. And I always get asked, Sean, where do you order your signs? Where do you order your signs? And I always avoid the question because I'm not trying to give my competition the heads up of, hey, you can get cheap signs made, you know, 100 signs for $100, $165 worth the stakes. I'm not trying to give them the heads up on that, you know. This is business. I'm trying to stay one up on the competition. 
And another thing is, guys, I know $100, $165 can be a lot of money to some guys. But if you land one solid account, guys, it's going to pay for this by itself. And I'll say it like this. Four years ago, I made signs by hand. I just did a, a bright neon green board, uh, black lettering with a, a permanent marker, and then I just taped over it and I put them out. I landed, God is my witness, I landed a $12,000 commercial account off of that sign, guys. No joke, that sign. When I went in and I sat down with them, they said, we've seen your sign up on such and such road. That's why we gave you a call. Now, tell me that's not crazy. That sign I probably had a dollar in, maybe a dollar sixty-five in, but I made it by hand and I had a lot of time in making those signs. Those signs took a lot of time. That's why I went ahead. I have ordered through other companies signs before, but I've never found a company that offers 100 signs for $99 with free shipping right now they're running, no joke. And you can get an additional 100 stakes for 65 bucks. So, you know guys, I hope this video really helps somebody out. I hope it doesn't help the guys out in my area because I know they're watching. I have competition that watches, I know. A lot of them are really cool and I'm cool with them, but this is business. I'm trying to make as much money for myself and my family and my business. And uh, you know, that's just what it is, guys. McDonald's and Burger King, they're uh, you know, they're not all over there hugging each other buddy buddy, you know. They still throw out commercials occasionally making fun of each other. I'm not gonna go to that extent, but I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. This is a cheap and effective way to directly market in the exact area that you wanna be, guys. I'm not putting all these signs out. I have a certain area that I'm targeting this area this year, and that's exactly where I'm gonna put my signs. There are gonna be so many signs. These people are not gonna have a choice but to see my name and my phone number. And you know what? Whenever it comes around to, hey, honey, uh, we really need to get the grass cut this year, or, you know, that guy last year didn't do such a good job. Maybe we should give that guy that put those signs on all the corners a call. That's what I'm talking about, guys. As always, guys, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. I'll talk to you later. And yes, I do know I say guys a lot. I'm sorry. Just is what it is. It's natural. Take it easy, fellas. Later.